in this section of the tutorial we will go over how to create target symbols in each piece, how to properly name the symbols and instances of the targets inside each piece, how to align the targets onto the pieces using the alignment properties, and how to turn the targets invisible. So to get started in this section, the first thing we're going to do is double click on our first puzzle piece, piece one. Now that will take you inside of puzzle piece one symbol. And we're going to take your layer that's currently there, rename it piece. We're going to create a new layer above that one, and we're going to name it tar. Now just like we did for your first targets, on the tar layer, we're going to get, pick our square draw tool and start drawing. Give this new target a new color fill and a new stroke fill so you can remember which targets it is that you're working with currently. Draw that target. Remember to keep it kind of small or near the size of your original target so that way they can find each other and snap together nicely. We're going to go ahead and convert this target to a symbol as well. We're going to name this one tar underscore MC with the center registration and make sure it's labeled as movie clip. For the instance name, we're going to give it an instance name of tar1 underscore mc. So now we're going to click on the alignment properties panel. We're going to give it a alignment vertical center. So go ahead and click there. We're going to give it a horizontal center alignment. Go ahead and click there. Now this will make your target inside of your piece lay directly where your targets from previous were placed. Now you're going to click go back to scene, click on scene, and what you're going to want to do is do the same exact thing we just did for all the rest of your puzzle pieces. You're going to want to double click on every piece individually and drag tar underscore mc from the library onto the panel and then you're going to want to do the vertical center line and the horizontal center line and you're going to want to convert the target to a symbol and you're going to want to give it instant name of tar the number of the puzzle piece you're working on underscore mc now do that for all of them Now go inside of each puzzle piece and click on the target and go to your color properties and you're going to want to select style go down to alpha and click on alpha. That will turn your target invisible so they're not seen when this puzzle is completed. When you're done making all of the targets inside of the individual pieces invisible using the style alpha channel, you're going to want to do so for our original targets that are on our scene. As you see, the targets will be invisible, and then we can move on to our next section of the tutorial.